Amanda. She's the owner of Purity Skin Studio here in Highlands Ranch. And we are here talking about skincare. Yeah. <laughs> and how to, um, how to keep your skin nice and clean. You know, when you're working out, you're sweating, getting nasty. Um, it's super important to take care of your skin. And so Amanda's gonna give us a few tips on how to keep it clean, um, some really quick and easy, fast things to do, maybe in between workouts, uh, to keep us fresh, young, yeah. strong. All that good stuff, right? <laughs> so, well, thank you, Malia. So, um, I deal with a lot of athletes. Just so you guys know a little bit about my background, is I've been in skincare for going on 17 years now. Oh my gosh, I she's a pro. Me sound old. <laughs> uh, and I do deal with a lot of athletes, CrossFit people, as well as high school athletes. And I am a certified acne specialist. And a lot of times when you're working out, um, acne comes with that because you're clogging your pores with sweat and things like that. So the best thing is to get on a good routine, washing your face every single night, every single morning, for a cleanser and a moisturizer and a serum that is based on what your skin type, skin condition, and skin needs are. However, when you're at the gym for several hours, yes. <laughs> or football practice, or yeah. whatever, um, camping, anything, um, where you're outside or you're sweating a lot, you're not gonna like stop to wash your face, right? That's not gonna happen. No, it's not real, really realistic. Yeah. Like, hey, let me lift this heavy weight. Okay, wait, hold on, everybody. Yeah. I, gotta, right. I gotta stop and go wash my face real quick. The number one thing I tell everybody is make a point within an hour of working out, whether it's football practice, whether it's CrossFit, whether you're at a CrossFit competition and you're there for eight hours, yes. I mean, you're there all <laughs> yeah, day. Yeah. Um, make it a point to run to the restroom and splash your face with cold water. I know it sounds kind of silly, but it's already counted 20. Do it 20 separate times. The reason why, if you just go, oh, splash, splash, oh, I'm good, and then you go and you sweat again, you didn't do anything. Yeah. But if you can count to 20 and you're doing full splashes to really remove all that residue, the sweat, oil, grime, everything, the chalk dust oh, yeah. that gets um, Think of it like a like an AMRAP, uh, 20 seconds, as many rounds as possible, yeah. splashing your face with cold water. Oh, we did it! Yes, yes. <laughs> I'm gonna talk about something that's really not popular and that's how dirty gyms are. So say somebody sneezes and then they're touching that and they're sweating and there's dirt and chalk and everything and then you pick up the same dumbbell, right? I keep looking down as if I have actually have dumbbells at home, which I don't. But, yeah, there's but, then, here, but so. then you do that, right? Then you're like, oh my God, and you wipe and you your pores are open from sweat. You just got all that nastiness into your skin. Guys, yeah, there's, maybe. There are lots of there's lots of germs and sweat. Lots of germs and sweat. <laughs> wash your hands, clean your face, wash your hands, clean your face. <laughs> um, so that's a huge reason why we need to wash our face. Uh, we don't have specific statistics on. <laughs> I don't have them right now, <laughs> sorry. Gyms are In disgusting, gym. they're really dirty. But here's my here's my thought process. That's sweat, <laughs> and then it gets the chalk on it, right? It stays on the ground, it stays yeah. on the ground. So if you can have those wipes in your bag, and so you're just using one at a time to constantly do that, and then the constant splashing cool water, you're gonna keep your skin so much cleaner than if you did nothing at all, or if you just used your dirty process. Um, so you don't wanna use anything that's gonna irritate the skin. You just wanna remove what you already have on there with the sweat, dirt, oil, residue, all that yucky stuff. So oh, you're working out, you're washing your face regularly, but you say, mm, Amanda, I'm still kind of experiencing a little bit of skin issues here. What else can I do to... Well, the number one thing you could do is get facials on a regular basis. If you're out there and you're working your muscles out, right, on a regular basis, you're getting your squats in on a regular basis, you brush your teeth on a regular basis, you go to the dentist on a regular basis, right? You're doing all these things to take care of your, of your body, right? You're trying to eat healthy, you're trying to drink lots of water. Um, get facials. A, getting a facial on a routine basis is like the same thing as working out. You're like, what? Yeah. what? It really is, I swear. It is, yeah. it is I swear. Work out for so your it's like a work, it's like a workout yeah. for your face, right? Exactly. Because you're doing all you're working out to keep your body in shape. By getting facials, you're keeping your face, your skin in shape. You're keeping this the the health and integrity of your skin at it, at its 
top peak. at its peak, at its top Ooh. level to compete, <laughs> right? Yes. Don't you want to walk outside the door and have your face look as good as your biceps and yeah. your shoulders? <laughs> I mean, I know you guys work hard at this stuff. Let me work hard on you, right? Yeah, yes, yes, so exactly. So facials are a great way to keep your skin clear, keep your skin healthy, and really strengthen the integrity and the health of your skin as well. There's a couple of products I brought out real quick um, just to tell you guys. So, yay. This is like a balancing cleanser. If you can see this, woo, woo, woo. So <laughs> balancing cleansers are great for people that have normal skin, have slightly dry, slightly oil, oily, maybe a little bit acneic. Um, it's a really great go-to to keep your skin balanced, right? You drink a ton of water mm -hmm. to keep your water levels balanced. So you need a, a cleanser that's gonna do the same. Um, we also have moisturizers, we have hydrating serums, we have all kinds of stuff for you. And then there is also when you have acne that you're just like, I'm stressing out, I can't get rid of it, I'm washing my face. There are specialty treatments, do, 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 if you can see the hats. Oh, I um, love tea, yeah. the tea treatments. Those so are it's, it's specialty to help just to kill the bacteria that gets stuck inside those pores from all that oil and sweat and everything going on. So, and you can always talk to somebody here. Um, we do have Molly around. Hey Molly, why don't you come over here real quick? She <laughs> is one of our acne specialists. This is Molly, say hi Molly. Hi. Hi. Molly, <laughs> Molly is great and she can help create a plan for you and get you going. So your face, your back, everything, all your skin looks as good as those big muscles. Don't, don't touch my muscles. <laughs>